what is happening everyone out there as you know it's your main man mr brookshire your boy and it is birthday time <laughs> another day reflecting and you know i just wanted to come on and i wanted to talk to each and every single one of you first of all i wanted to thank you um, for those that have taken their time or taken their time so far and will through the course of the day and or the month, the week, whatever, to say happy birthday, to wish me well, to send blessings my direction, to say a nice little word or two. Those things are very fun. Uh, reading a little mem flash back down memory lane kind of thing. I appreciate that. I just want you guys to know that because, you know, you don't have to take the time out your day to do it and the fact that you're doing it, it means a lot to me and I want you guys to know. Uh, I just wanted to come real fast, real quick, like just to tell each and every single one of you about how important, you know, this is a new birthday year for me, but how important courage played a part and has played a part in just my life moving forward. It's kind of like a what I know for sure on this birthday, this another day that God has blessed me to be here healthy, safe, uh, in my right mind, going after my dreams, as I say, with both hands, you know, here again to to do that with you guys, being able to bring in new content. Uh, for all of you guys out there that haven't checked out the On Channel, please go check out On Channel Streaming Service. Uh, we put a lot of work into that. Big shout outs to Maurice, Brian White, all the partners in the On Channel, uh, www.theonchannel.com um, on all your social media apps. Thank you for being a blessing and growing that to multiple countries around the world. Thank you for coming and being a part of my shows. Thank you for being a part of my growth over the years, guys. Uh, your blessings, your, your kind words, the things that you type, the instant messengers, the DMs that are sent uh, with positive affirmations, uh, they mean a lot. You know, being out here, grinding, going after life, not always the easiest. But I, as I said, as the start of this conversation is courage, your courage, as G.I. Joe said, knowing is only half the battle. So taking what you know and applying it, applied knowledge, courage to apply that knowledge is going to be the virtue of all virtues that are going to, that, that will allow you to be able to actually live, all right, within the, the things that you're going after to allow a dream that was once in your mind, in, in, in your head to become a reality that other people are benefiting from. It allows you to be able to stand in the gap if you're an activist. It allows you to be able to stand up for your family and be a, an example. Courage to do, courage to act. And what I want all my Libra people out there and everyone that may have gone through something this year, everyone that's going through something, I just want you guys to just make sure you hold on to the courage that you have to be able to do. Uh, know that the one thing that you do have control over, no matter what the outcomes are, no matter what the situation is, is you have the, the, the control over your mind. You have the control over how you perceive and how you per take things in, the perception that you bring into things. You have the courage. <laughs> you have the courage to be able to stand firm and to be able to stand strong. And, and that is what I've learned. Uh, and that is what I know for sure, is that no matter what knowledge that you have, no matter what you grab or grow after and grow through, courage is the virtue that brings it all together. Because without it, you can't do the things that you're put here to do. And one thing that I know is that we're all put here to do something so great. You weren't just some meat suit put here to just suck up oxygen. You were put here, my brothers and sisters, my kings and queens, my royal minded folks to do something so great in this world, no matter what it is. If you're sucking up oxygen right now, you have the opportunity to tell your story. I mean, there's the self-help industry is a billion, billion, I mean, multiple 50, 60, 70 billion dollar industry because people told their story, no matter how triumph, uh, it was or how bad it was or how much you triumph through it. They told their story. And so I just want each and every single one of you, as I grow through this birthday and I appreciate all the words of wisdom and the, and the positive affirmations and everybody, again, as I said, taking their time out to actually write something and send something with me in mind. I also just thank you guys. Uh, I just want you guys to just reach for it. All right. 
reach for that best you, reach for that best self, reach for that best thing that you can see. Remember, if you can see it in your mind, it's already here. Thoughts have a frequency that can be measured. It's a real thing. That's why you feel it on the inside. So they say, what, what I always say is where your mind and your heart go, your body will follow. Because what we have to do sometimes to get it in our head, even if it's a new way of thinking, we have to get that in our heads repetitively. They say sometimes you have to repeat the same process, sometimes 13, 14 times to get it in your head and to get it in your heart. And then once you have it in there, it turns sometimes into a belief system. Now, that's not always the case. Sometimes some things can happen quicker depending on circumstances, the situations that are coming at you where that belief system is ingrained faster. But for those that it's not, there is a process of how you can do it uh, to be able to make it work out for you. And so I just encourage each and every single one of you just again, like I said, go out to life. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Um, remember, courage is the, the word of the day. It's the word of the year. It's a thing that is the virtue that pulls it all together. It's having the courage to do uh, what you know to do. And we're going to say no to do in a positive light. Things are going to uplift people. Things are going to bring uh, smiles and happiness and solve problems. Be a problem solver, not a problem creator, problem solver. Um, and so I just say, Go after your life, folks. Imagine yourself reaching for it with both hands, seeing that better you and reaching for it with both hands. You have what it takes. You are amazingly great, and I know that you're here to do something well. And I just continue to thank you for praying for me, praying for my family, praying for my teams and my businesses um, and lifting us up. Um, and uh, thank you. Many, many, many blessings. Again. I really appreciate your birthday love and uh, may you continue to reach for yours and may God bless you. May you have the synergy and the people around you to be able to help fulfill your wants, your dreams, and even your desires. And uh, may you be blessed and encourage others to do the same. Love you guys. Signing out. <laughs> Thanks again.